Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we are once again doing a livery design and today we got something very very cool for you guys. This is actually a design that I've seen on Twitter. I kind of wanted to put it into Gran Turismo. So we're going to use the basis of this car for it. Uh, this comes from Demaron. Demaron. Yep. 155. Um, who said uh, that he made a Ty Gibbs Chick fil A car. Um, so this is going to be me trying to recreate that in Gran Turismo, but with my own little twist to it, of course. Uh, so we're going to throw it up on the screen here. If anybody's seen this design, um, this is the design that they made. Okay, he did a cool job with that. I like what he did. Um, so we're going to take this because we're going to use the, the Supra um, as our basis of it. This is currently my Tyler Reddick Jumpman car, uh, but we're going we're gonna to alter it a little bit. Uh, the reason I went with this is because I like some of the text uh, locations on it that we have for the text that says Camry, but actually says Supra. So, I liked that. So, we're going to go and delete all of this, because this we don't need. That's kind of just in the way. Um, Alright, these are not going on the car. Alright. Um, so, the monster portion of it can actually kind of just stay where it is. We're going to leave that. Um, I kind of like how it is on this car. Um, maybe we'll adjust a little bit. Maybe we'll do something like this. Bring it, bring it down a little bit more. And then we'll duplicate that on the opposite side. All right, I like how that looks. That that's got a little bit better, better vibe to it. Um, all right, decals. So the rear wing. Is that other? That's other. Oh, I know what I did. I just painted the rear wing yellow. Okay, so I made a playoff variant for this car because I believe it was ran at Darlington as well as Cocos 100. So we had the Cocos 100 one for a while, and then when it was ran at Darlington, I made the change to it, added the yellow for the playoffs. Ty Gibbs isn't in the playoffs, so we're not getting that on the car. I'm going to have to get more whatever the red for Chick-fil-A is. We'll get the official color of that. So let me just get that real quick. I didn't think of that. Hmm. All right. The thing that's annoying about this game it doesn't use hex codes. It uses HSV. So. What we actually need now is. This. Hex to HSV color converter. All right, so we need to go to 350. This goes to 94. And this goes to 90. Okay, that's that's solid. We'll take it. Doesn't really look much different than what we had. Um, 
All right, so on that car, it's got the 54 in red and then the white background. So this we can replace and we'll put um, he gets us on that spot. It's probably where it'd be on the actual car. All right, and we will duplicate that on the opposite side and we will delete the one that says pinnacle. Now, where does it say uh, this one? All right, so replace the decal. See, a lot of the nice thing is we can just replace the decals. Um, where is this one? I don't think it's this far back. Now that's Ty Gibbs from last year. Where's Ty Gibbs name and logo for this year? Changed it up. Changed up his logo. There it is. Alright, so we will duplicate that on the opposite side. Delete the one that says Tyler Reddick. Alright, so let's do the windshield banner uh, first of all we got a Toyota logo this is the one that's actually used on the car so I finally was able to get Toyota logo on a square so that's good uh, we will delete that what color is the banner gonna well, the banner should just be black yeah okay replace that I have so many decals saved. Eventually, you just gotta put this stuff in folders. I may um, go through and have to do that at some point. Maybe make like a NASCAR folder or something. Because this is just a little out of hand after a while. Uh, so, going across the body of the car, we got white basically from the front. And it flows to the back of the car. So my thought with that hmm. Oh, what the hell? I mean, that's kind of doing what we wanted to do. Kind of wanted to do that. Do I want to do that? Um... And I kind of like what we have here. Yeah, let's see if we align with surface again.
See, this isn't really doing what I want it to do. To be honest, I kind of just want, like... I mean, what do I need? It really just needs to be a straight line across the car. It's not that wild. You think about it, it's basically this. <sighs> Actually, I kind of like that. Then you think about it, we add this on it. Where's that go on the car? It's not supposed to go over the white, that's the thing. But, if we did this... Kind of like it. Um, so this TRD, I kind of want to put it into white. that Toyota logo. Alright, so we'll do that. And this one we'll delete. And then we will add... Um, there should be one that says, like... Sunoco Rookie Contender. There it is. Alright. That's fine. Alright, it's looking good. So the McDonald's logo I mean you gotta replace it with interstate batteries. Uh, where is interstate batteries? Third page. Somewhere. Did I miss it? Am I dumb? Can't be this far onto that page. There it is. Let's see. There's got to be something else on the side of these cards. I think it's like... <clears throat> I think it's... Not on that one. There's one that's like... I think it's Sherwin-Williams is on the side of it. Was it Sherwin-Williams? Trying to find one of the car, dude. Damn. 
them. That's just understood batteries. A lot of times it's just understood batteries, I guess. All right, sounds good to me. Um, all right, let's see, we will do... Give me a Cup Series logo. Where's that at? That may be further down the list. Cup Series Champion. Just want the regular one. says eat more chicken we're gonna put there also put that in white all right and then the back of the car Get another just Chick fil A on it. All right, rear window, we'll just center it, and then we will place it. Hello. Did I not look hard enough? I didn't look hard enough. All right. Um, also for the rear windows though, we've been adding in the lines look kind of more like the next gen car does. So these go in orange, and they get duplicated on the opposite side. All right, there we go. So the banner's good. Everything looks good. All right, Goodyear. Where does it say Goodyear? I can go back to being in white, I guess. Why not? Or go to being in white, I should say. All right, 
so. We'll do this. Get a Toyota logo. Each one has this on it. And then we get a sports clip. Alright, so, body two, should be pretty easy. So, replace the decal, we'll put Joe Gibbs Racing on it, wherever that is on this list, that's not it, that's it, alright. I think at this point it's literally the numbers because let's see we've changed everything over it's looking good i don't want to do that one first for the numbers i gotta figure out what we're doing here how does it look with a regular 54. Or should we do one of the ones in color? I think the yellow would necessarily look good. I mean, I don't really mind the white, the gray. So. Kind of like it the way it is. All right. <laughs> All right. That's going to take me to where? fine with that so we go to the roof now though and I do have this which makes it look like there's roof flaps in the car Hello, where are you, number? Is it on this page? No way it's on this page. Page 205.
I like it. I like it. All right. That's going to do it. <sighs> that's my interpretation. This is the render that was made on Twitter. Um, and again, they're, they're a little different, but I definitely uh, like what I've done here. Kind of like the the white fading lines I think is very cool. Do I with it with the red numbers, but um I kind of have the white on the white. But overall I'm a fan. So I hope you guys uh enjoyed today's video. And uh we'll see you guys in the next one.